All right, Justin, thank you. The time now 447 new this morning as the number of cases of COVID-19 continues to rise. So does the cost of treatment. So do you know how much a hospital stay for the coronavirus might be? Well, Mark Roper looks into those numbers. The pandemic is expected to cost the healthcare industry billions of dollars and patients worried about their health also might be wondering how much treatment is going to cost them. So we asked Johns Hopkins Medicine Senior Medical Director Dr. Scott Berkowitz to find out. This is, a, this is about people. It's about patients and families and trying to do right by them and trying to help all as a big team to get through this together. Researchers at the Peterson and Kaiser Family Foundation took a look at the cost to hospitals, patients, and providers for COVID-19 and compared it to similar cost of treatment for pneumonia. They found inpatient treatment for COVID-19 could cost employer health insurance and the people enrolled in those plans more than $9,000 for patients without complications and more than $20,000 for those with serious complications or those who have underlying health issues. And the price can skyrocket the longer a patient stays in the hospital, especially if they need a ventilator. More than four days with a ventilator, that cost in that hospitalization tends to cost more than $90,000, uh, while it's uh, more in the 30s for those who are hospitalized for four days or less. Depending upon a patient's level of coverage, much of that may be paid by their insurance. But the study also found nearly one out of every five patients admitted in network for pneumonia ended up with a surprise bill out of network, something a White House spokesperson says the Trump administration is working on to prevent. Typically, employer-sponsored plans will have about a $1,400 on average deductible. Uh, and also, in addition to that, the out-of-pocket expenses that may be expected for a patient who's hospitalized with a COVID-related infection could be as up as high as $1,400 as well. The nonprofit group Fair Health estimates total hospital charges for COVID-19 treatment in the U.S. could range from about $360 billion to nearly $1.5 trillion. Meanwhile, the healthcare industry will have to figure out who will pay for it. There is some support that's coming through the stimulus bill to the hospitals, and I know that that's being worked out right now. Uh, and I think that that's to help keep the providers and healthcare industry harmless. But clearly, there's tremendous complexity here around the financial side, and I would imagine that some of these things need to be worked out over time. And that was Mark Roper reporting.